What was the toughest moment you had to deal with in the music industry? The toughest moment was when I had to choose between staying here and taking care of my babies. They were babies at the time mm -hmm. and committing to my job at the church or going on a three month tour with Stevie Wonder. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. So I ended up not going on the tour mm -hmm. because I was a single parent and uh, I had three boys, three baby boys, and they were like three, four, and five. And so there was no one that I was going to leave my children with for three months while I went gallivanting around the world. It was hard. It was a very hard decision because Stevie was my idol. And, and I talked about earlier when you first asked me about who, when I fell in love with music, after that experience with my mom teaching us how to sing, when Songs in the Key of Life came out, Stevie's, which to me is one of the greatest musical productions ever. I would lay in my bed and listen to, I was in, in middle school and I would lay in my bed with my headphones and my cassette player. And I would listen to songs in the key of life over and over and over. And I fell in love with that. And, and I, Stevie Wonder was such an inspiration and like my idol back then. So to have the opportunity to tour with him was a dream, but I had to turn it down because I had the babies and I had to keep my job at the church. So that was one of the most difficult uh, things that I went through in the industry. However, there's a beautiful side to that story. It, I, told, I just told you, I celebrated my 60th birthday a, a few months in March this year. And my son threw me a huge party, amazing party. And guess who came to my party and sang happy birthday to me? <laughs> Stevie oh, Wonder. Wow. 